let's see what is the item this is the item so this is the two key i'll be i'll be programming into this so i'll put this key first I come to programmer you accept you come to chip it from mcu chip reading writing you come to EEPROM. Now you look for, you so come right here. All right, 8025, 8025080. This is the IC number. Okay, you come back to EEPROM. Now you read. This is the, the file for the for this IC, now you're gonna save this file. I will be saving this file in this. All right. Okay. All right. This is the five uh, file I'll be saving it with. All right. Let's save it. All right. Let's save it. Now you exit. You exit. You exit. Exit. You exit. You exit. Now you come to the right key via DOM. When you come to the right key via DOM, you click. Our XP400 is connected already. You OK. You come to Asia. Then now you look for Toyota. This is Toyota. Click on Toyota. Now you look for Toyota Corolla. We are working on Toyota Corolla ETM. All right. Toyota Corolla 95080. You select that. Now you're going to load the file. Okay, you see? You don't have any file right here now. You load this file. You come to Bob. This is the file we save. You OK it. Data loader, select the key number to be operated and press generate key to start key generation. Okay. You see, we have three keys already in the system. Now I'll be adding these two keys to make it out of four keys in this five keys in the system. So this is the first key I just choose. I'll be placing it right there. Then now I choose number number four. Now you make key. Okay, add a key, key number four. Yes. Do you want to save the new generator file? No. We don't want to save it yet. Yet. So you come to no. Key generated. Write back the new generator being file corresponding to. Complete a key right here, done. Okay. Now we already choose key number five, four, right? This is key number four already in the system. So I'll be choosing key number five already. Now you see, key number four is already in use. This is a key. I'll be placing another key right there. So I'll, now I will select key number five again. You okay? Add a key number five. Yes. Creating data this way. Now, do you want to save the new generator file? Yes. All right. Uh, SP40. All right, I will save it here again. All right, now you save it. All right, key generator, write back the newly generated bin file into the corresponding chip to complete the entire key write, write key via DOM process. All right.
you OK it. Now you see we have number four key is already in use, number five key is already in use. So now you're going to exit again and go to programmer. Come back to programmer. Come to programmer. All right, now you come right there again. Shape key from MCU. You OK? You come back. You come back to EPROM. Yes. 25, 25, 80. <clears throat> so, I am not reading this again. You want to write it now. Come to write. Bob, come to the file. Open the Bob file. Okay, this is it. Now you write it. You okay. All right, shape rating successfully. All right, now you can exit. All right, thanks for watching Lies Electrical Garage. Uh, this is how we can we can add two key on bench on Toyota. So this is the way you can do add two keys. Even if it is not a Toyota, any other cars, once you do it on bench, you can add to the game. So that is it. Thanks for watching Live Electrical Garage. Keep on subscribing. Don't forget to turn the notification bell for more videos like this so you can be notified.